All right, what's going on guys? It's Panzer Dragon. Today, you know, the last review I wanted to do on Nisa's coaching, uh, it ended up being really troll and grief because the guy was a conspiracy theorist. Um, but, you know, I actually wanted to see how one of Nisa's coaching sessions is and see if he's right and see, you know, am I agreeing with him, disagreeing with him on certain things? I got to see, right? Is his coaching worth $350? Let's find out. Saving puppies and kittens. I'm going to be helping the trash duo or Yasuo, depending on how good this guy is, uh, hopefully get beyond gold. Um, we're going to see if this guy knows how to play the wind shitter properly. So stand by. I'm going to show you guys how to play this champion. Um, and hopefully we can get to some good, some good teachable moments. But yeah, let's get some LPs. I'm going to call this guy right now. Do this. Yo, what up, man? Yo, what's up? Not much. <clears throat> so I am sharing my screen now. Uh, welcome, welcome. This is NA, correct? Cool. We're working on Yasuo. Uh, I'm loading in right now. Explain how this account is playing so well in there right now. Explain what's going on here. Um, well, I've been playing for a few years. Um, and I have been playing Yasuo for a while. Yes. Okay. Um, the other night, as you might see, there's a random spot where I'm playing like Ezreal, Yonate, Hecarim that was full tilt, um, like late at night. Um, but I've been playing Yasuo. 82% win rate. Uh, I feel like safely, I guess. Like I'm not going for like crazy kills, um, as you can maybe see from like the low yeah, kill yeah. counts on <clears throat> yeah. the rest of them. What do you need me for? Doing... You're doing well. Yeah, what the hell? I, um, well, I actually- This is good. Yeah, like I, I think I'm doing well. I get I get like super nervous though. Um, like okay. playing the games, like there there's times like where I won't play like at all uh, because I do have like fear of rank for a lot. Um, just because uh, I do feel where certain times like I feel like maybe I should have rotated, but I didn't because I saw something else versus like what the rest of the team saw. Mm -hmm. um, and my goal is just like I really want to like, climb more. Efficiently in a you know, um, maybe up to I guess like emerald considering that's like the new rank once everything <clears> so high what, what what this guy really what he paid 350 coaching just for <laughs> This is something you don't get coaching for until you're a little bit maybe higher and hard stuck. What the hell as you've climbed to Um, this is it I mean, you're climb. It's so funny you say climbing efficiently. This is like as efficient as it gets. I mean, right now, yeah, it's gonna get harder. Don't get me wrong. But like, right? And well, I feel like a lot of my games I've gotten kind of lucky though too. Like the last game I played, um, where we won, I actually ended up getting uh, top. Um, I basically hover Yasuo immediately, so nobody bans it. Right. Um, and then I saw that I got like Irelia mid, and then I saw a Poppy, and I was like, oh man, because it's like. Like, I just, I know that she has, like, the, um, you can't dash around her kind of thing. Yeah, and then, right, like, right. she's just, like, full tank and everything. Um, and I, I died to her early, thinking that I could get, like, a kill off, because she kind of, she tanked two towers, or two we towers. Can look at, we can then... peek it real quick, so I can see what your game looks like, too. Um, let me, let me see. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you're going crazy. So, <clears throat> let's talk about this. Okay. So, you, 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 all right, let's talk about how this lane looks and what you should be trying to do. These trades are the trades you want. If I'm being right. real, um, oh, you Jesus. really just want to slow push in and just survive the early. In my smart. This would be your mm. work rush too, by the way. Uh, if, since you're probably going to wind up matching her, Gale just has right. like negative purpose Damage, in, yeah. in this type of scenario. As for like second item though, I would have to do a little research because I've never been in this situation. Yasuo top is pretty archaic. Yeah, that, I know. I haven't seen it in so damn long that. Yeah, I know whenever, because she kills me, I believe we land a little bit more, and then either I die again, or we just both reset. She actually goes mid against Irelia, and Zed comes top. Like, they kind of, like, did, like, this weird back and forth thing. Like, I really got to kill on Zed. This Poppy is, well, this Poppy is actually smart for going W. Like, uh, damn, that's a good cheese. Poppy got to kill me, they kind of swapped, and then I end up killing Zed, and then they kind of, like, swap back a little bit. <laughs> like, it's, like, a weird back and forth. Yeah, mm. like, they didn't know. Who 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 matches up better, right? Um, I'm more confident playing into Zed, personally, um, because I know his kit better. But um, yeah, yeah I think I you know I don't want to get too deep into the weeds on itemization, but in your case, you're winning quite a bit, mm -hmm. so we can talk about it. I think in a situation okay. like this where I have such a shitty matchup, I think I would just go Bork into like uh, 
like frozen fist or something or frozen gauntlet iceborne gauntlet right um, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to disagree with that one although I would say it is a bad matchup Poppy can max W second uh, so I would I, I don't know about Bork I mean I guess he could go Iceborne he could go Hallbreaker if you really want to but hey this guy has Ignite are we playing for team fights? not a lot of setup actually he probably looks like a Hallbreaker I would never do the whole, the, the Bork setup on the uh I mean, I guess you're against a tank. There's only one tank on the team. You're facing Poppy mainly. I would probably just do Kraken Slayer, to be honest. Kraken Slayer is... So, like, you don't need Bork anymore. Just, Kraken Slayer is like... Um, OP. Okay. The idea being that, you know, you're never really supposed to just beat this guy, but if you get Bork but, and Ice... But I don't... Uh, Nice doesn't play Yasuo. Like, like, let's... I don't think he plays Yasuo. Iceborne, Gauntlet, second. Oh, wait. Iceborne... Okay into 4 AD I I honestly don't mind that one like I would be like cracking into 4 AD kind of a hole breaker tank yasso maybe I guess yeah you could basically just win by the you're still at the level where players just farm like jack shit all the time and if, as long as you hit your CS a lot of matchups won't be able to keep up because it's hard to hit CS I mean period point blank if you play a tank right. <clears throat> top the only reason I, I like I said 4 AD is it's insane value. Of course you can just go death stand. Like, I mean, you could it's good at value. Of course, there's Kraken into what? Infinity Edge, whatever you want, uh Gale Force, uh whatever. Like I said, whatever. It's a poppy though. Yeah. Gale Force maybe not the best, but like I said, Kraken, Gale Force into Death Stance. You could go that route, but the Iceborne Gauntlet could be kind of annoying and you could hit a there's a lot of setup from a Mumu, to be honest. So, when you're playing like Poppy, Maokai, shit like that, Shen, these guys are gonna fall behind and farm. So you already seem like you're disciplined and you're willing to play out a long game, judging by the result that you've had and just like your explanation of it. You're like, ah, I'm farming. I'm just waiting, playing a slow game. Great. Then just say, I'm gonna chill. I'm in low elo. I just gotta hit my farm, get to Bort, get to Iceborne Gauntlet, and split, and I'm probably gonna win. Um, just by the virtue of the okay. fact that like no one can duel me and I could just work side lanes and then pick my battles that I like. Uh, additionally, right. <clears throat> ignite in a lane like this. Yeah, I uh, I kind of messed up. I told, as soon as I as soon as the the screen locked, I was like, ah, I should have taken. It's teleport. not terrible, <laughs> but yeah, I think teleport. If, if your play style is like you're cool with chilling anyways, and you're confident enough mm -hmm. in your in your long game, and then like I normally don't recommend teleport, but you seem like you have the right mindset to kind of utilize it and understand like, well, I can just chill, hit my farm, right. And then yeah. as I'm splitting, I can just shove lanes in and look to TP when it's applicable, right? Right. But yeah, with this, with this like goofy trade, you're not really looking to do any of this. Instead, what you should be thinking is just like, I'm gonna slow push, build a huge wave so that I don't fuck this lane up. Because right. the fact that you're even, that you've even established the push first Poppy is good news. Cause she's pretty AIDS as you can see. The key here is this, you can't, you can't handshake these so like these passives so watch you should be watching her passive cooldown mm. uh, not the cooldown itself but like watch you'll see what i mean here in a second so six five four three two one watch her character that when you see okay. the little flash <laughs> that basically means that she's going to have to choose she's gonna have to hit a minion or hit you eventually someday uh, okay Normally what right. I do at that stage is I just play the brush and wait it out when I'm playing these types okay. of champions where I have no sustain whatsoever. If you had your passive shield up, maybe you could tank it just to be like, I need to farm, like fuck yourself. Mm -hmm. right. Or if you have wind wall, I need to farm, fuck yourself, right? But when you don't right. have them, you can't handshake it because this is what fucks your lane, ready? Watch, oh, grass proc yeah. plus that mm -hmm. is killing your lane. Now you take yeah. that, you do that like two or three times, you lose every trade when you have no sustain. This is why like Fiora, um, you know, Jax and like Trindamir and all that's why we all hate this fucking matchup because it's <laughs> like there's so much juggling and then aside from trying to space that and get away from it you can also contest the shield if you want okay. right but so can she <laughs> so right, like right, right. there's just a lot and then this is why this matchup is so bad and then if you go to <laughs> if you go to a wall somewhere on accident 
now you really fucking screwed. So but. ideally your game plan is to <laughs> just cancel out the lane phase and mm -hmm. because your champion just can't do anything to it. You don't have like a Cassiopeia or like a Jace or something that can actually like do anything to this. So right. <clears throat> realistically what you should be thinking is like, all right, I've got the push, let's maintain it and let's battle this, um, you know, these HP, uh, basically these uh, taxes on our HP that we're going to have to deal with with this fucking passive right. and and all that bullshit and try to avoid taking cues. So there's that's uh, the reason I lay this out for you is because this is one of the hardest lanes in the game. And yeah. so being away from walls, being away from the passive, um, being aware that like while you're pushing up, she can cue you. It's just a shit. And then the dashes, right? So there's just right. so much, it, you know, people talk about Kisante being overtuned. Poppy's quite overtuned actually right but we me, just don't see her very much so no one bitches like about we're going it. in circles right now but, uh, right anyways but, yeah so see. it makes sense that you had a hard time with this lane i wouldn't be too discouraged <clears throat> just be happy that you don't see it often have you ever asked somebody how to get good at League of Legends and they tell you to just get good, but you have no idea what the hell get good means? Everyone talks about roaming, but we're not talking about what cell phones. This? Everyone has heard of the term freezing, but what are they even saying? Do they want you to wear a coat? This guy stinks! My coaching costs a lot of money, so much that everybody bitches about it. Bruh. I've coached over thousands of people for the past three years. I'm the number one most experienced coach in the video game, and now you can get cheap coaching through Patreon. Isn't that exciting? Yes, this it is. We teach every single concept concept in League of Legends by the book so you know exactly what it is you need to do to climb out of your elos. We've got fundamentals for each and every single elo broken down in order of importance and eventually we'll even have a special tier for people that want to make money playing video games. Isn't that awesome? Hell yeah it is. You gotta check it out right now. Do not be a dumbass. Go sign up right now to Nice University or you're stupid. Go sign up right now before you miss the opportunity to climb out of bronze you low elo shitter. Why are you waiting? Why are you still here? Why are you not at patreon.com slash Nice University? Are you stupid? That's probably why you're an iron. Go sign up right now you noob did you know turrets do a lot of damage sign up now for nice university you'll find out more amazing tips for 350 dollars but actually it's a lot cheaper than that now anyways vlad is aids yeah i sure. don't like this much okay. <laughs> no one does it sucks oh unintended okay, Playing well, like this you probably benefit a d shield i feel like d shield i don't know what else happened to this vod i don't know if they edited it out but i feel like he could there's probably a little bit more to go over right i, I want to kind of See how it ends, but uh, maybe it's edited out. Cheaper than that now. I, I usually, so. I think, yeah, it usually depends. I know in most matchups, mid, considering they have like the range and stuff, I'll go like second win D shield, uh, unless I think I can like abuse them. Right? D like, shield. Like, super use like TF or something. Once Vladimir um, gets ahead of you and sustain, you're you're pretty dead if he's yeah. Good. Wait, so I'm trying to right. make it so that that never happens. I would go on Doran's um, blade here. I have lost. I, he's one of the only champions that is like, when I play like Trinomir and I like fall behind and sustain, I'm like, oh wait, I can't just sustain through this. I just lose, and that's that's happened to me before. So be very careful with Vladimir and like, I I would recommend since most Vladimir players can't play mid to late for shit, I would just farm with him, um, and then. Jungle ganks. Okay. Yeah, you're vi Oh, what is that? Yasuo could hard poop on Vlad mean? early. Vlad, Vlad's weakest points. It means that they might be looking for an invade. But like levels one yeah, to five. So. And then after That'd seven, nine. Is that, oh. Yeah, I mean, maybe, I mean, especially considering I thought maybe we would invade considering we have like Nautilus mm -hmm. Vi, but they didn't want to. I, I literally pinged on the way and they just cautioned me. <laughs> yeah, they didn't uh, want it. I'm so shocked he went D shield. What the hell? And he's got 82% win so rate like on Yasuo. player just wants to do this too. Like, if I step up, I guarantee they just come up just the auto my shield. Crazy. Yeah, it's good that you're holding it though. You're yeah, right that's thing. really Hold good. It. Really good, actually. Wow. But I'm still at... Like, level 2 is when Yasuo we can fight him. We didn't figure out where Hecarim started, which is kind of on me. I should have had you, like, look at the map. Art um, all in at level 2. It looked like they did. They came in a little bit later. Yeah. <clears throat> Probably a way to a hard all in level two. I mean, I'm down two. to just chill until the game state makes us have to make a move. Um, right. There's no real evidence that anything scary is happening yet, so. Cool. Right here, no? I mean, you gotta get the farm first, but I'm so shocked. It's just not a good time to go in. Yeah, and actually, considering the Once the his lane... blood well is used here, I would make a heavy trade. Yeah. Right. Yeah, there we so go. We'll look at a quick trade. Yeah, trade, trade right now before he gets it. Yeah, up. Uh, yep. he could have done Come this back. a long yeah. time ago. 
I thought. That's what you want now. Yes, this is why you do it. He's gonna have to. Good. That's oh. good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's oh, good. he could have flash Q auto ignite. You Whatever. Flash, it's okay. okay. I think. I'm surprised. Is he, he's, he feels nervous. Well, I want to gank it again, but he has pool. Try to get his pool right now. Just start trading like Psycho. Yeah. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Whoa. You got move sums. I was trying to kill you both. Careful. The jungler can come. No. Careful. Back to lane. You're going way Wait, too this... wide. Not necessary. You, you're you winning. You just have to zone now. Use your pot. Because now we can all in this guy. Oh. So Vlad is going to go back. Yeah, next time, put your wind wall up here. What? You were yeah. tanking. Whoa, yeah. brother. Whoa. I like my health, brother. Kind of right. Now, this means that Vlad backed, which is good for you because now he's super delayed. And that's okay that he's super delayed. Uh, it's all right. I mean, yeah, you should actually stay. That's true. Got a huge freeze. Now, <clears throat> what you do here is you do have an all in option, but the problem is if Hecarim's around here. Oh, he's bottom. So when this guy, Vlad shows up, I'm going to heavy trade. I'm going to heavy trade Where's right Vlad's now. No items. time to think. He needs to know. Yeah. Dark yep. shield? Okay, nice. You can actually fight. And go right back in. Right back in. Be annoying as fuck. Okay, nice shot. Well, I still want some. He needs to get... If he get 1100, I think that's Berserker Grease, right? And trade back to the minions. That's good. Oh, no. Good. Keep queuing. Keep queuing. Keep queuing. Keep queuing. You're also must queue. Okay. okay, we can turn. We can turn. Go, go, go. We can turn this. Ping it. Ignite that motherfucker, oh, though. Fuck, that was unlucky as fuck, is what that was. Yeah, was. Ignite him. You need to ignite him and trade. It's yeah, it's Hecarim. Trust me. I play Hecarim. Okay. Uh, you did the right thing stepping away. Uh, okay, let's take a recall. Can I watch, like... Hey, that was... I was gonna, like, EQ an auto and then ignite him, but that was really unlucky. <laughs> Like, did this hacker run a? a why did I did feel he... like this is there's something wrong here? Uh, something. Um, we... like, what? What? what we'll went back to the minions. That's good. Good queue on him. Good. Keep queuing. Keep queuing. Keep queuing. Keep queuing. You're also... I. I don't know if I would tell. So if I was uh, Nisa, I wouldn't tell him to queue. I, I would let Yasuo do his own thing. But like, because like I obviously would think he would queue. I don't know. So must keep I feel like this guy has an 82% win rate on Yasuo, so I, I wouldn't really tell him how to play play his champion. I would tell him like, oh, you guys maybe win this? This is a little you. risky. Like he's trying to space up. Okay, we can the... turn. We can turn. Go, go, go. We... I, I don't really think they can turn because there's no, there's no like kill window on the head. He probably has three sacks of his kill. The kill window is appears right here. Um, but I would think he has to flash, auto Q, ignite, E. That's like the only way he can kill him, but I don't know if that's enough damage. Ignite that motherfucker, though. That was unlucky as fuck, is what that was. Yeah. yeah was. Ignite. And now, that's just, just turned off, uh, like, super need... awkward. That's what... Like, I was just like, oh, maybe you win this. Oh, you don't win this. I mean, maybe you win this. You do ignite him in trade. It's, it's like, really... It's, yeah, it's Hecarim, trust me. I play Hecarim. How close it was. He did the right thing stepping away. I also I wouldn't have told him to ignite. <laughs> uh, I would have been like. Anyways, yeah, I wouldn't tell him to ignite. Yeah. Unless he saw a kill. Hey, that was I was gonna like EQ an auto and then ignite him, but that was really unlucky. In my opinion, I wouldn't did this run, teach him how to play the champion. Phase rush or did he go conquer? Yeah, yeah, he went phase. Oh yeah, you should have you should have been a lot more confident there. He has negative damage right now. I play right. Hecarim. That, that champion's trash early. So, and right. he, three, he needs a tier. Is OP. Three? Of, like, I, I, Q stack uh, is OP. Like more Doesn't matter if he has face rush. Um, how does his Q stack work? Because I hear people like say about like his Q stack, but I have no idea how the hell that works. You can't do anything about that. Okay. He's just stacking it off of minions before he ganks. So, like, it, theoretically, if he's standing next to chickens before the gank, he should try to, like, pull the chickens away and spam mm -hmm. his Q. It gives him more Qs in a fight. Like for me, I know it's it's really hard to concentrate in game, um, when someone's backseating you and like talking behind your head. That's why I I pull most of it after the vod and the vod review. Like there, but if um, if you in my opinion, in my opinion, 
it's so hard to take so much information. I know this. A lot of people have flamed me for my coaching. Says, why don't you talk? Why don't you tell them like how to do X, Y, Z, and like how to do uh, log algorithms, and at this point, do algebra while he's playing Yasuo and one v one. It's 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 because they won't absorb the information. They have to absorb it after the game's done. Too much things coming in. Made it a little but bit no, faster no. to the Hecarim and have actually a, stayed on him. Video you would have killed him. Because right? I, I know how weak he is processor. early. I mean, obviously play Hecarim practically when I'm not coaching right now. Right. But like that guy, that guy is exploitable really, really early. And the fact that you guys got into a long fight with him and he got out is just very bad because he should have died for that shit. That was the only way he absorbs all this information is if he if if he's autopiloting his champion and trying to listen to Nice while play. it's so hard unless. You, like, especially if you have ADHD, it's so hard. Unless, like I said, if you're autopiloting, you can't absorb all of this information. It's super hard. Trash by him. But I don't try to, I don't try to, like, tell him all this. I tell him, try to tell him after. Make sure you fling that tornado at him, though. We're not friends. Wait, what? Make sure you fling that tornado at him, though. We're okay, not now, friends. Now, 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 yeah, why didn't he throw it at him? What the hell? Oh gosh. Oh, he doesn't get this red Q. Wow. That's like decent spacing. I'd use refill. You need to have your health high. Yeah. Um, I don't know, man. I think this is this is getting pretty spooky now. We didn't get the kill that we wanted. Right. So we're just gonna chill with him for now. Um I will just let Vi do her thing. We'll we'll all hit six together and maybe we can set up an, a nice ult kill. He's thinking about ganking, but he has pool. I'm so scared. Trade, trade heavy. Just trade heavy. That's what you got to do in these spots. Okay. Dead. Ult off. Yeah, you have to ult off. Wow. Good job. Why did that guy? You should have flash autoed there for sure. Just hard shove. I don't know. I don't know why I thought I had a. I had, had a, ignite I on him. Had ignite. Yeah. Uh, you got bot lane rotating. Careful. Careful. Pull away. I do have ignite up soon. I yeah, I mean, <clears throat> you have ult soon too. So what we can do is. Yeah. Uh, uh, Okay, this guy's obviously nervous. I can't flame him for like he's eighty two percent win rate, Yasuo. But I already know he's nervous, so like, you know, happens. We could I, definitely pressure, try to land some tornadoes on him or something. I did expect. I have high expectations for this guy. Uh, but now I can tell he's playing nervous. So, I would. A try. Good idea with the tornado there. I can appreciate a good mind yaming. It would also be stressful if you're playing I'm rent we while getting coached. I'm just going to play up on the tower. He has no ult. <laughs> he has no way to kill you. Okay. Right. I'm not convinced that we die to it. And you can tell, like, if I don't think you die to something, you're going to see me kill him say, here. go for it. Okay. Shit, he kills him here. Oh, wait. Keep queuing, keep queuing. You can set up a kill right here if you can stat. Like, you could, like, flash queue if you can fucking hit it. <laughs> I'm going to E onto that. Ult ignite. That's, that's his kill. Good. That's unlucky. Maybe try to go for the kill. Yeah. Oh, no. yeah, he healed a little bit more than I thought. But either way, I think it's a good look. Um, uh, yeah, that's good. Don't be afraid. Like when it, when the trades are shaky like that, don't what? be afraid to just go for the trade kill at that point. The, what? Trade yeah. one for one. Yeah. What? Zero yeah. One. yeah. I'd rather, I'd rather get us both getting gold than just him. Oh, they got that, right? He's nervous. Yeah. That's okay. He's fighting into the Aatrox. Doom ball. Yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, maybe he really does have those those rank jitters. Push mid hard and then zone is what I would do here. He's gotta come back to mid zone him. Zone him. He wants to come back. Okay, shove in plates. plates. I don't think two plates is cool. Yeah. Seems like, safe. Yeah. I would like no, just uh, pull on back. Here? Maybe, uh... Here. He said What did he say? He said stop him from coming to mid. Push mid hard and then zone is what I would do here. He's got to come back to mid zone him. So I, I wouldn't zone. I would say hover. Look at him. And then just I, I wouldn't zone him here. There's no way he's coming back mid uh, at this hit point. He wants to come back. I would just tell him to go mid. Hey, shove in place. But like he lost maybe one or two cool. seconds. Seems safe. Yeah. Hovering the river. Now we just pull on back. Maybe uh, rotate the bottom here. It's an equal wave state. Yeah. He yeah, doesn't have to back yet. He wore, uh, it's clear the pink though. So here. What you do here is you ward over this. You have two wards, but I don't know if he, it's so hard to communicate this. Ward over there. Where? <laughs> there. It's it's super hard. So here, 
ward over this wall. This ward, the wall. Basically, if you ward over here, you ward, and someone else wards over here in their blue bluff. How can they ever gank mid or bottom? At, and you have so much information. Upper bush. Which this is this upper bush? This which which upper bush? Ward of the wall. Uh, yeah, it's it's hard to communicate. So, lots of things to process through my mind. Ward, I gotta ward this. Hit this ward. Maybe I can gank bot. No. Okay, I'll shove one more mid. The first. Then buy whatever. All right, we've shown, so they're gonna back down for sure. It's a ward over the wall. Yep. <clears throat> okay. Well, yeah. Just wait a bit. Wait a bit. Wait a bit. Stress them out. Don't show. There's no reason to show. Okay. Bot lane has to be afraid of it for a second. Now you peek out. See what I mean? Um. Has to be afraid. Of it. Wait a bit. Oh. Yep. <clears throat> they saw him clear to pink and they saw him leave here technically go here but there's no way i i wouldn't wait a bit just wait a bit wait a bit wait a bit he cleared the board. don't show there's no reason to show okay bot lane has to be afraid of it for a second now you peek out see what i mean i wouldn't have i wouldn't have given up that cs but red had or vlad had red q you can all in here yep rare get all in kite back kite back it's sketch yeah. Is not I just sketch. don't know where Hecram is and he could just Wait. gank you here and you'd be completely justified. And Aatrox is popping, so... I, I don't think it's sketch because he has a ward here, so there's no gank opportunity here. Your Vi is hovering topside. Her ward is kind of crap, but... I I don't know why I knew who was bottom. I, I forgot why. Yeah, I just maybe saw a mini-map. Uh, so I mean, you want to just clear the wave as fast as he comes under, though, because Vlad might move to Vi after. I don't know what he Hecram moved after that because the video skipped. Oh really? my goodness. All right, rotate, rotate to buy. Rotate to buy in case Hecarim drops him. There's nothing for you to do right now, right? So This is correct. Right. You can ward over the and wall and get a better ward. And get some gold. No. <laughs> or not. <laughs> but you did just get gold. 700. Oh, oh, oh I was yeah, just You can ward over the wall and get a better gold. ward. Yeah, yeah. That's why you rotate. I mean, it sucks that the Vi like wants to like 1v9 carry. Like I, I might have been annoyed with you if I was popping off and you rotated over and jacked some gold. But realistically, right. It's not that bad for your mid to get some gold too. One more. And then maybe right. get a recall I, I think a hard shove and recall is probably fine. This guy has pool, so... You can try like an idiot and then try and Yeah, just hard shove, pool. whatever. No, you should do this. Yep, keep shoving. Get in his face, be annoying. Can... Oh, maybe you could R there. Get his, like... Yep. You shouldn't get his pool. Because you want Hecarim to come here for the counter anyways. He's he's trying to set you up for Hecarim gank, I think. His movement's weird. Yeah. Uh, recall, recall. Like I said, all about the mid push. Okay, there it is. Yeah, see, he was around. Uh, no, undo that. Go no. BF sword. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I yeah. usually, I usually go like Zeal just because. Like, I'm with the, you. The I'm with you. But that, speeds. that is just the hard buy, okay. and you but can you, buy it cold. Okay. So. What was it? What was the buy here? Yes. Yeah, see, he was around. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Uh, no, undo that. Go BF yeah, sword. Yeah. 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 Okay, okay, that's yeah, I what usually, the hell. I usually go like Zeal just because like, I'm with the, you. I'm with you. But that speed. that is just the hard buy. Okay. And He's you can right. Buy it cold, so right. Okay. Remember yeah. That's yeah. Hard buy. There's some buys that are harder than others, so you might as well just get the hard buy out of the way. Yeah, I, Zeal just feels so good because of the move speed. I know. And with the E. Yeah. I shove, 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 shove first. Shove, shove. first. Absolutely. Shove. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. It's a two plate. It's a two plate push. Yeah. Mm hmm. He's right. You just bought a BF sword and your Yasuo. I'm pretty sure it's two plates. Correct. Hey, one plate. What over? He needs maybe to ward that push right there. With this patch change, yeah. This push needs to be warded. Either or way, though. You can say, oh, 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 you've got to take the plate. It was just a little yeah. bit of damage. Like, that would have been okay. All oh. right. All right. Let's uh, just shove again. Yes. I'm okay with shoving right now. You have it flash is risky up. to go for that plate. Because we don't know Vlad who's has bottom. Not backed yet. We have, so push. I definitely wouldn't. And I like this back steps to top river too, because you could get him all in here. On. And I wouldn't have gone here because I don't know what the hell is going on here. And I don't know why it's been so long, but. He's cutting out the, the red Q though. I just fall back. How much for Gale? That's what I'd be thinking. You can now ward the river. Yeah, it's not much. You okay. Like you can ward so the river. So he's got to get a plate. <clears throat> plate and a few more waves and we should be good to go. Oh, oh he missed we it. just missed the plate because we weren't near. Fuck. Oh. Yeah. I didn't see that. It's my bad. Damn, you need to ward uh, something or like. I was thinking about uh warding like right here for. Yes, gank, maybe. I, I like that ward. Yeah, yeah. I mean, arc seems all bot, but. 
guess he can never R this Vlad. Oops. I feel like he could, but at the same time, it doesn't seem like it. Honestly, this matchup does seem harder now. <laughs> I was waiting for him to do that. There it is. But he can R. This idea is a little... He needs to war the chickens. Aww. Ambitious. Go ahead and shove. What is that? You got Vi behind you, shove. Just yeah. get the wave under. You can win while the majority of this team fight anyways. What over the wall? Like he's, she's rifting. She's yeah. rifting. Yeah. He won't do anything. Wow. 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 Wow, she walked up. Oh! oh wait. Wait, where's uh, the wind ball there? I don't know. Well, where's the wind ball there? What? That was weird. At least you didn't yeah, die to I, it. That's, shove, shove, yeah. shove. Everyone's just kind of jacking off in his wave. I don't like that. We can get this tower down and get the gold. Give your passive. I would just hover the tower. Just hover it. You don't have to auto. You don't have to auto. Minions will get it. See what I mean? Yeah. And you'll get the local. Uh, okay. Recall, recall. You got Gale. Your team's zoning. Yep. Keep your eye on Vlad. Put the ward over the wall. Yes, this ward oh, needed wall. to happen. Yeah, check it. Check it over. Let him know you're watching him, and then you'll get the recall. He won't move. Great. You can go top. Please 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 go. Uh, you are top. You're top for your team. Yeah. Yeah. You go duel this guy with Gale. Yes. Thank you. Hold tab. Check his items. We're about to fuck him thank up. Thank you. Thank you. All thank right. This you. is our duel. Yeah. So he has, you know, his tabbies, but you have ignite. So it's on you. I mean. If he hits E, it's a little spooky. He might lose, but you have ignite, so I don't think you do. So I would just get right up on him. He doesn't Let's expect see. the oh, rotation he can win as this. fast as it's, it's gonna so be. Easy. So go, go hard, go hard. Like don't fuck with him. Don't fuck with him. Just go. Win will the W. Win will. Oh my God, he's so good. It's a nice block, dude. Ignite him. He kills him here. Alawi, there you go. You win. Oh, he gale force though. I'm not sure. He needs to gale force to dodge a tentacle. Shut up. I know. That was very good that you win while the, the gale force e, is pretty it bad. Work. But since you win while the E, I knew I know you win. It's item versus no item. It's always good. It's a really right. good duel to win. Here. I like the patient play. You've patiently farmed up. You got good farm and you went off to the side and just picked up a nice easy duel for a tower win. That's a good that's a good sequence in my opinion. When I coach, my mini map my map awareness is mad. horrible. We didn't W the E, I think. Oh. I don't actually oh, don't know. Wow. Yeah, that's kind of my bad on the call. I didn't think the rotation was coming. So we should probably yeah. probably just got the kill shove and fall back. Sometimes I mean, and give him credit. Yeah. Uh, Usually here, I just hold tap. This is, a, this is a Boric angle, I think. I okay. think so. I yeah, do, I think so. I, I think it is. There's a lot of health on their team. Yeah, yeah this, this will feel deal. good when you get it, especially if you wind up side laning versus these guys. <laughs> yeah, yes, you're right. You go My holds top. I was hoping. A lot of times, like, I'll see that, but they will not. Like, they'll just farm and then move. You out, have to, get, you have to trust that they're not brainless. No. You also have to ping them. Yeah. You can't all in allow you, but you can clear the wave. Bork. You can clear it quick. Clear it quick so you can unlock rooms. I mean, it's actually good against Vlad, you have no to be honest. Right? So I'm, I'm leaving. I don't want to be here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We rotate. Yeah. We rotate. Poke your nose at it. See if they're low or anything. Put a ward down. Careful. Who's their jungler again? Okay. Oh, Hecarim? Hecarim doesn't cool. build hit point. Oh, there it is. That's what you're looking for. <clears throat> R, 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 R. You do win. You do win. He's out of line. I don't. I hope he Grab doesn't go bork. Yeah, I think that's where you're going. Yeah. Yep. <clears throat> bork will really help with those types of like weird chasing fights too. Push up, push up first. Vlad beats you on the rotation. There's no, it's there's good. no beating it's him. He's there first. Good, I guess. But... Just push. Man, the hundred percent crit. Now rotate down. Now rotate down. Drop down. Oh, he's bad. He's sitting in mid. He's bad. Now you, now you win. <laughs> also, it's an overcap on attack speed. He should have already been there. Do you see? It's 1.33. Yeah. Oh, they probably kill them both anyway. Yeah. yeah. Take a recall. Slam recall then. Mm. Do you see what I mean? He could have won the game there. Can you hard push this if he way? Just, <clears throat> if he just rotates there, he 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 cleaned the fucking map. Yeah, grab that. Yep, grab what you can. Oh. Sell the recall. Sell. You see how like mid unlocks roams like that? If he The fact that he missed that is like really bad for him. At Rome, if he shows up and gets a triple, he ends the game like by himself if he's good. Oh, go in hard. Go in hard. You get the flank coming. I say it's worth a look. Gonna he is going to pull. He missed four minions. Okay, or he's going to. He's still Don't all in. Don't all in. He's strong. Don't all in. He'll beat you. He'll beat you. He'll beat you. He will beat you. I'm telling you. <laughs> he should. Uh... Oh, I mean, I should have. 
Yeah, yeah maybe, better. maybe. But you shouldn't uh, have been. You shouldn't have been involved in it. You should have left. Yeah. You. I didn't think he was gonna do that much damage. Holy shit. I, uh, I mean, I'm right here. I'm telling you. Yeah. <laughs> He's strong. He needs to life steal off wolves. Life steal off uh, wolves. We get on the top. Actually, you have an angle on top instead of just sitting life, in the tower. Life steal doing wolves. Life you should eat. Wolves. Rotate. Maybe take plant here and start working tower. Cause yeah, if you ever find yourself stuck in a situation like that, just sneak away and get your farm. Cause you'll heal up a little Can bit and then you'll be able to duel somebody with ignite anyways, right? Right. Push up fast. Fuck. And then I just back up and probably recall it because you got Bork, right? Hold, Ye hold. Yeah, start recalling, right, yeah. but watch the map. Watch the map. If there's five bottom, we're going to push, okay? All right. No, you're good. No. Yeah, not Damn. Uh, I would wait. I would wait. I'd wait. Hey, screwed up. It's not. You're not losing anything. <clears throat> you're okay. Okay. So oh. Like yeah. Yeah. I mean, that's longer than my rule of like 25:30, but I think this is a right. good exception. I actually uh, thought Bork yeah, was 600, like whatever. Up to 20 usually, but after that, I think 20. 12 percent. Like like hurt health damage though. Yeah. This is this spike is so huge here. If you get Let's it. Let's watch. Um, this is like, like I said, this is the winningest Yasuo build. And here, I think you can justify it because you got a Vlad, you have a Hecarim, you have a, a Lowey that you're fighting. That's a lot of champions with a lot of wiggliness and a lot of health, right? Not to mention they're easy to, to whack on as Yasuo. This is all on his. You want to draw somebody to you, to be honest. You're, you have a split push build, essentially. Hecarim wants a piece. Keep pushing. See if this is good. All right. Ward below you. I it's not that good in team as good in team fights. Push one more wave. A good split they don't know push you're build. here. Push one more wave. Push one more wave. They clearly don't give a shit. Or make him give a shit. Push hard. Camera on mid. Cool. Ping them off. You don't want them to get engaged on. If they if the enemy team figures out that they can engage, your team dies. I'm it's telling like you. It's like some kind of hole build. Hecker might come for you. I pull back. Yep. Pull back. Oh no, he has to, Yeah, uh -oh. that's good. That's good. That's his only escape. You better you yeah this is gonna be you pull to your team and hope i guess now if you can get an oh he didn't oh, r oh, yeah I'm you need to jam you need to jam it. it yeah i was jamming the hell out of that oh she just beats the hell out of everybody yeah that oh. vlad does counter yeah, you killed your name? team i think because you or you might have got lucky yeah you need to back off oh, like no. i told you why are you running forward he has to uh, you I have gale yeah, yes. I thought Hecarim was the only one coming, so I figured if I could just go and loop around no. him. No. I think he no, has you killed to. the fuck out of our team on this. You need to just yeah. walk back out like I told you. Walk back out. I'm here Hecarim for push, a reason. Because that right the there, tower. you could have just pulled back, dueled Hecarim, won the game, and you did all this fancy shit. That was like needlessly fancy. Go towards shield bow. Shield bow? Okay. Yeah. It's knocked in tower. But he could also, like I said, he could actually kite that as well, yes. They're on it. Hmm. Let's just ping it. They're on it. You could also I want to stop their backs. I don't want to let them recall. Walk out of tower. You've got Nautilus set auto up for Q, Auto E, whatever. Oh, they're not on it. All right, push up top. Yeah, they should have been. They're bad. There's low yeah. elo moments. They should have did Baron True. eons ago. I don't know if he can dual hack around. I just I need to know his items. He could, spit, he could like fight him while kiting away. I do think he might die. one more and just uh, assess map. Really Hecarim depends on Hecarim's items. Uh, if Hecarim is over two items, then yeah, he could right, actually win that fight. Shove and back up. Back up. All right, we could group. We could group or on mid and engage. Less group than on mid two and engage. Items. Ping it. Ping the engage. Hecarim's in top. Ping it. That's fine. Tell them to kill themselves in mid. That's good. They should. <laughs> if, if you guys fight at this moment, now Hecarim's back. Careful. Right, yeah, I mean, top. he has to go Hallbreaker. Check the, the map his, state. What's going his, on his here? His build Hecarim's is so Hallbreaker. 14. He's got the Dante's build. Oh, careful. Your team's fighting. Can we go to mid? Camera, camera on it. We need to know if they're winning or losing. I think it's good. You need to try to get there if we can. Shove mid and stack your Q. Stack your Q and shove. Uh, okay, maybe? No, it's uh, gone. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Out you go. Out you go. Out you go. You have Ignite for Hecarim. You can kill Hecarim, but you got to Q him. Ignite him. Oh, he wasted Gale Force. Good. Oh. Yeah, try to. All right, we're probably dead. Try to waste their time. That's all you can do here. <gasps> oh, you're the goat. Oh, wow. You're the goat. Q. Yes, Q. Why yes. So many. Go to bottom. Run to bottom here because if they bear and we want to push bot. Okay. 
Yep, take that, yep. take that, take that, take that. Here they go. Run to bottom, though. Run to bottom. Oh, he actually is lives? Is going to chase? I don't like his Gale Force usage. Wave. Do not go to the wave if they're chasing. Just run down. All right, let's turn with let's turn with our teammate. You got ult. You got ult. Turn with your teammate. They're TPing. Yep. Look at the map. Look at the map. Look at the map. Oh. Yes, 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 yes. Get there. Where Where's this pathing uh, right now? I'm losing brain damage. Yeah. Or brain yeah. cells. I'm getting brain damage. This is... Yeah. All right. <laughs> That's fine. Oh, that is good. That is, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's what you want. That's what you want there. Yeah. That's their main team, the really. Yeah, the okay. point of second on my fucking ulti could have got the passive shield up. Yeah, yeah, you're good. I mean, his build's so uh -oh. life steal he's heavy. Fine. No, he's not. Big ball. Oh, uh -oh. so life steal oh, heavy. He that's why I was yeah, really I excited like, was getting Vlad against the Vlad. Vlad. That's what's gonna win their death ball fights every time. Right, uh, those two. Yeah. Uh, is this ping Baron? Started pinging the shit out of it right now. You guys need to go for it right now. Why is the enemy team yes, not Vlad's building scary. armor? Yes, allow is scary, but you really should pressure it while you have numbers. Skip the wave for now. If they look like they're collapsing, you need to try to ping your team off. Okay. Allow we... Okay, go in, go in, go in, go in, go in, go in. Oh, if we could... Okay, ping them off. This is shit, I think. Help them though, help them, but you need to like try to ping uh, them off. Yeah. Good. Good, 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 good. That's the right play. Uh, you just wanted to uh, see if any of them step out of position and rotation, get hooked by a Nautilus, shit like that. All right, so we push all this out. Push it out, push it out. We need to get our shield though for the next fight. Yeah. No one's on you, so push. More. You're faster than they are. Push. Except for Hecarim, who you can duel, which you've seen you can duel. Get in the bush, get in the bush. And just get in the bush and recall. Uh, Okay. Okay. <laughs> now shield bow. Grab it and get on the map. You Sh could work bottom. The shield problem is you kill your oh! team often if you do this. Um, yeah, we want to have pressure these two lanes. Yeah, it's, it kind of sucks because like I want to split, but they're really strong in a team fight, and your team is kind of weak. So I don't. I think he they'll get. He doesn't need any more attack needs. speed. What the fuck? Uh, um, the play here is to just see if Nautilus knocks somebody. Stacking up cues. He needs a shits. shield though, but no more attack speed. Not efficient. Go to Baron. Pressure Baron. Pull them off. Pull if them I saw this, build, uh oh, wait a second. If my Astro built this, I, I'd be like, okay. By the shield bow. He doesn't play Astro. Yeah, I know. Engage here, careful. Wait, what do you? Who's yeah, doesn't play Astro? Nice. I know he doesn't. Try to keep mid shoved and then threaten Baron again. I don't. I, I think you, don't, you guys don't have to start it, but you should be trying to get Yasuo. out of this A Ram scenario because it's not good. Or it's better. Than, oh. Okay, I was gonna say it's better if you guys can, if you can open and it's, kill somebody. I don't know. It's whatever. It's, oh, it actually did recall. Good ignite, I think. He kills Hecarim here. Good. You still have R. Run uh, from this. Her ult. Her ult is good here. Yeah. I think. Oh, wait, did she miss E? She did miss E. Yikes. <clears throat> what a messy game to coach this was. Yeah. Go to Baron. It should be it should be uh GG though off of that. Uh says ping by. She can't split here. What's she going? She gonna farm golems while we have Baron? Oh my goodness. Can can I just yeah. get one utility defense you item? Engage your team's near enough. Is this like you can GA? Engage, you can like engage anything. your team's near enough. 100 percent Oh my goodness. You're creating like this Vlad sucks. I mean it's gold. Sorry, my bad, my bad, my bad. My bad. My bad. What just happened to my Meta? You have ult in 14. Sit back and wait for it. Sit back and play for your ult. Relax. Relax. Play for your ult. You don't want to die when you're about to have it up. Yeah. Alright, now play for it. Ping it. Ping it. Why the fuck do they want a base? The fuck? Okay, back oh. up. She hit E. She hit E. Okay, Aatrox wanted to TP top. That makes a little bit more sense. Okay, that makes a little sense. Um, uh, I mean... I would just hover them with wind wall. Like, hover the minions. Buff the minions. Like, uh, like I said, I'm nitpicking everything I see, right? I'm nitpicking, so I'm looking for some things I don't like and sometimes, you know, whatever. But that doesn't mean he's coaching. He's not bad. He knows. He knows. I'm just, I'm just nitpicking. But like I said, now play for it. Ping it. Ping it. Why the fuck do they want to like die when you're about to have it? You have ult in 14. Sit back and wait for it. Sit back and play for your ult. Relax. Relax. Play for your ult. You don't. A lot of. A lot of uh, 
words to just say back off. You know what I mean? That's that's like I said, I want to keep it simple. Just back off. Chill. They want to back because I, I wouldn't even explain. They want to back because they're low hit point. I would just say you could chill, do whatever. Like go top lane if you want. They want to back. You know what? They want to die but, base. Like I said, I, I like to keep it okay, simple. Up, and then it gets easy, hardcore easy. into the review. Like here's what you could have okay, done better. Okay, Aatrox wanted the TP top. That makes a little bit more sense. Should okay, you go heal that cut? Makes sense. Wait, heal cut is so disgusting. This game. Um, I mean, I would just cover wow, them with wind three wall, heal like cover cutters. the minions, buff the minions, buff the minions. What do you build on Yasuo heal cut? You can't yep, go so that your Q, previous your, your wounds thing. Aatrox is one v nine, so you need to try to dive this guy or something. Try to dive him. What do you build on? <laughs> he shouldn't. His right, whole team fine. should. Give pressure. I keep shoving. Aatrox died, so shove and fall back. He can't build it. It's so weird on Yasuo, but he's he like not. How much do we need for GA? Go to Wolves. Don't just stand here. Go to Wolves. Go to Wolves. I guess he could sure build wolves. it. It's inefficient with his these, ulti like, though. Blank states where you just stare at shit. You need to find something else to do. You're Yasuo. You could be fucking eat and farm. He can right. like he can build I it. Jam a recall. Jam a recall here. You get speed back. Yeah. He can he build goes, it. You can get a stopwatch. So you can dive. Hold tab. All right. So we have uh, <clears throat> soul point. Or it's soul just not drag. efficient. So we should just push up and look to fight. It's horrible as a group. on him. Assist ping mid. Try to ace him right here while we're waiting for Baron. We're stronger. It's horrible on him. It's so hard to do it. It's not. Uh, it's it's in this game. It is a little bit more efficient than shield bow. A little. I not. I don't know, man. Someone else should build it. I mean, this Vi has a thorn mail for whatever reason. Instead of chipmunk sword. Hey, that's a kill. We want to fight. Oh, gotta get all there. That. This looks bad. There's a death ball I was afraid oh. of finally happening. This Here's looks the good news. If bad. you guys do lose this fight somehow, you're not losing Baron, which is why I kind of wanted it here. I wanted to see if we could win, gonna... end the game before Baron spawns so we don't have to fight on Baron as a group. Yeah. Here's how much his, the Vlad canceled his your ult. did, though. Yeah. I'm seeing all the options that you're missing, though. There was definitely one at Chickens there that you could have hit. I think you're ignited. Yeah, on the heck room. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so at this point, you can't take any more team fights. Because if you take any more team fights uh, before Baron spawns, it's GG. Yeah, just shove mid, though. Here. Shove mid up. I'm mid. I'm mid. Okay. Yeah, hold tab. You're, full, yes. you're level 18, so there's no splitting, in my opinion, here. You don't want to. You don't want to fight though. Let's just ping Baron. Let's just ping Baron and move to go top, top now. Yeah, you should go top. So let's just. You just want to make sure that your team doesn't just get like destroyed while you're gone, right? So I was saying, Hallbreaker somewhere would be awesome, but. So now you just grab this wave, push it out, clear it quick, and then group. So much life group steal. Down. Careful, this Hecarim collapse. So they've got Pryo. And crit. Uh, only two crit. Okay, they're not looking fine. at you. Camera, camera. All right, they're getting mad. So now we show up. Uh, is this actually work? I don't know who that is, Callista. You have a GA, don't panic. Just do as much as you can. Oh. Now ignite somebody, uh, dude. You gotta throw that ignite down. Oh, this guy's got thorn mail. Uh, wiggle, 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 wiggle. Oh, that hit. No way that actually hit me. I don't, that was so weird. I hit. I actually, uh, want a team a fight too. Team. Supports only one standing. GG. Uh, assist ping Baron. They need to be going to Baron. They can't just stand. Yeah, what is this? Oh, it works. Yes, yeah, assist ping Baron a bunch. Okay. Because there's no waves. Yeah, at this point, I'd probably oh, get like. Go here. Uh, uh, if it were me, I think I would go like Death Dance or Bloodthirster. Uh, this game, uh, I think probably Death no. Dance. Oh, thank sense. God. It's yeah, better, it's but. Everything's yeah, still tilting. To that and just be near our team. Shove mid first, and then we'll go from there. Everything's still tilting. He needs. He does. I mean, I don't. I didn't see how much grievous wounds his team has. If his team doesn't have any Enough grievous wounds, besides Vi's That's shitty thorn mail, that doesn't affect just Vlad. Rotate, 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 rotate. You don't have to clear every single one. Just make sure we're in position. I, I'd probably just go heal. I don't know, man. This team is so awkward. Oh, I would have ulted off that. Maybe. It worked actually. It was CC. Uh, it actually got Vlad, you know. Oh, wow. Yeah. I think they lose this game now. I think you're actually right to not ult off of it. Now I think about it because Renata. Yeah. I think it's okay. Hopefully your team doesn't get. Oh, Vlad. Yeah, 
flat is just insane. Yeah, I don't know. Ezreal's up though. He can play ball for a bit. I really think healing reduction is, is really clear. nice here. Mm, they're gonna get Elder. Um, they can't get Elder and Baron. Oh though, my God! Game's getting shit. What do we do here? I think you're right so about the grievous they get Elder. thing. Man, these team fights are just fucking whack now. I knew they would be though eventually, because they they just the comp is just so good in team fight. At this stage, you guys really have to try to get. Uh, you have to survive, honestly. It's so I think survive. I just to type get it, survive the, Baron Elder and wait it out or wait it out or whatever and try to get here. them to do it. I know yeah. typing's bad, but I think we have an exception because it's a late game scenario, right? Shove mid out though. You don't you don't face check anything here. You just shove waves and live. Shove uh if you guys fight for Baron, you lose the whole game. I'm just letting you know. You know Aatrox and Vi have thorns? There's... Try to cheat forward mid. So though, stupid if, you can, if we're going thorn mail. I would say give Baron and survive. Like they're so stupid. It doesn't affect Vlad. He's not gonna auto attack you. Oh, he does have thorn mail. Have a lot of oh, they just need chipmunk sword. Yeah. Yeah, like this build, like this build. Is... Now you just gotta survive it. <clears throat> you oh. have wind wall. You have Ezreal cues. They this don't game? have. They're pretty short range, actually. Gale Force. Team. I think you're okay. Yeah. I really do. Maybe BT. Your goal here is wait for the wave, and then you need to just that right there. Ezreal just needs to poke like a motherfucker, and you need to wind wall when it gets close. So wind wall and clear. You need to wind and wall then... and clear. This game Clear and just wind wall. depends what yeah. you're what, if Back you want up, a team wait fight. Wave. Ping them off. Wait and ping your wind wall timer. Hellbreaker. Oh, sorry. <laughs> yeah, if they're not on the wave, clear it. I, GA for team fights. You Hellbreaker if you want to right split. Now? That's what you want. And then the somewhere a chipmunk and a fourth Chief, item chipmunk no, sword. Forward and so you see another guy oh, sorry. Him bot. You can get a chipmunk sword yeah. if you really want to. I don't actually think it's that. Yeah. Good on Yasuo because it gives ability haste. This situation sucks. Uh, they're gonna I, I take would, some stuff. I'd probably go Mortar Reminder. That's to be expected. I'd probably go Mortar Reminder. They're building armor yeah, on. Windwall, 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 Windwall. Never even. They can't touch you guys. <laughs> that feels a little okay. weak. You gotta follow it. If he hits, you gotta follow. You have to. They're fighting on Elder. They should lose this. I knew it. They lost. Now you need to try uh, to get out. Run forward, flash forward, and run. Yeah. Ooh, I like this. Oh. OP. Yeah. So my idea was you guys swing a quick pick and get out. Then right. we were kind of like stuck because then the eight the TP came in. Whoever TP, that was a good TP by them. The yeah, elder was, was running out. TP'd. I yeah. think. Is it I don't out? Know if you're dead, I don't know if you lose. Like I said, you're pretty short range, or they're pretty short range. Um, Ezreal, no. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> you guys are okay. Like I said, you're going to lose stuff, but you don't lose the game. No. Grievous Wounds now check is not timers useless on against Vlad. Shit. What do they got? I healing the is not based click, click off Omni-Vamp. Do you know Omni how to do this shit or what? I'm talking oh, yeah, Elder. Yeah. I'm talking Elder. Elder uh, Baron timers. Omni no, like their timers. Like, do they oh. have Baron and Elder anymore? Oh, I have no idea. I don't know how to do that, actually. You click. Okay, so you click their champion portrait. No, like, okay. they have to be on the map. Like, don't you have to see uh, them and click them. You can heal like off and then... a 5,000 right. MR Munda. Yes. Okay. And he, That's funny he won't that you die. That. Go put shove. I don't think they have anything. Yeah. Now, see, you need yeah, to move no. your camera to Alawi because she's the only one that, or one of the only ones that lived. So click, like there, move your camera, click on her, left click. Does she have anything? No, she does not. So we no. know that we can fight now. Can we rotate? Okay, there's a guy dead. We might have to wait Ezreal spawn. Okay, two dead. We wait the spawns and we try to survive. Uh, uh, no, just go uh, proxy, proxy, man. I guess, uh, no, he has to proxy mid, make sure there's no end. But yeah, he's gonna die at Hackram. Good. We got a turtle under tower here in base. We probably have already lost, to be honest, but we'll see. They don't have a wave yet. Yeah, I know Nice doesn't play Yasuo. Stay behind tower, and then. Can there we are ways item? to figure out what to finish item what the build. No? Not, not, no, no, not no. Yet. Like 100 gold. Yeah. <laughs> like. When the wave comes under, you got a wind wall and start. Like. I would have gone, like I said, the Gale Force, whatever. I don't care. Infinity at Gale Force. I don't know what you want to switch to. If you're going Bork, then you might as well build Hullbreaker, the split push, right? And then if you go, then I don't know. It's like a team fight build for going GA. So that's why Bork is not better. <coughs> Bork is shittier in team fights because they're all probably executed and Bloodthirst is better. They're clearing. <laughs> ah! All right, wind wall clear. Nice idea. 
That's the way I see it. 15 seconds on Ezreal. Oh, he already. Oh, he, he's still gonna die. The flat guys are off. Yeah. Yeah, they just death ball the fuck out of you guys. Ugh. <laughs> yeah. Well, <clears throat> like I said, the agency was lost on the tier two push. Right. At that point, I mean, then it's just team fighting goofiness and and you know they just had a better comp. <laughs> Is there a vod review? I mean, we could probably nitpick mechanics but at the end of the day i think your decision to do whatever weird shit you did at the tier two was the most the damning thing yeah okay like uh okay. go look at it real quick well let me try to find it because in my opinion that's where it went off the rails you basically baited your team and then you need to understand dude when you have bork gale don't be fancy just back up back up walk backwards right that was so goofy go. and needless yeah i yeah, he can't kill you. I, like, ex <laughs> right? No, I just yeah, like I said, like I, I had, uh, I thought Hecarim. Well, like I saw, I knew Hecarim was coming. And I thought he was the only one coming. And then usually, like I can just like wiggle around and like just walk out like an opposite direction. But uh, obviously, that didn't work. But, but my point is, why would you want to wiggle out? You want to fight him, just trade and leave. Depends on his eyes. You have Gale Force. You kick his ass and leave. That's like needlessly. Look, 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 look. Watch. This Can't is exactly this. what I said happened too. He comes rotating, <laughs> and then you have a wave. And you literally broke all league rules. He's level 12 in your minions fighting mm -hmm. you. He's, He's level about 12. This one, though. He's trying to like, yeah. you could see yeah. people I'll play. and you could just kite away. No one can catch you. They have no engage. Look. He's right about that. Right. And I know that. That's what I'm telling you. I'm like, they can't kill you. Like he, right. your team is here. So if they get too crazy and chase back, they just fold up. You literally okay. put yourself between the, the entire team. There. Look at that. Yeah. He's right with this one, though. Just walk out. You can actually That's fight you, him. You have get, your, you have Gale take Force. Take the E from uh, so you just, and just All you him. needed to do was just walk up and start queuing. Or walk back out and start queuing. I wouldn't even have E'd. I would have just queued and walked backwards. Right. Can you take it also? Yeah, he would have been and then just E after. Anyway. Forward. Yeah. But this was just crazy, like needlessly fancy. And then now we're just, huh. we're basically inting here. To me, you had the game won until you did this shit. Was this helpful today? Yeah, yeah. yeah no, it was, it was very helpful. Yeah, I just, I know I, uh, I feel like at least like once a game I do that where like I just, I, I feel like I see something that I really don't or it's like not even really possible like that. Or I'm like, okay, yeah, like I can just E forward and then just like walk out kind of thing. You have to be willing you know, to trade once you have items. That's my point. Right. You're, 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 you're not, you're not in lane phase anymore. You need to scrap now. You're trying to yeah. be perfectly like rotational, but like it's different when you're, in a lane that you can't just dominate but like we had farmed up we had our items you had the levels and then you're just like well i don't want to trade it's like no dude like he's not allowed to stand there you're that's illegal right. he can't do that you could just walk backwards and queue and kite away but like i, I you know i tell you guys like you're pretty good at kiting with cues your Bunch problem is you try to be needlessly mechanics, diff like you try to be needlessly it. macro centric in mid game that's done. what that in the like to me. okay like just so like would you say like I should just probably more like fight more whenever like the odds definitely favor me? Cause I feel like that's right. where I definitely like lack is like I'm, I'm I'm afraid of fighting because like I'm like oh I'm gonna die if I try to fight here. No, no, but... you're not because you can limit test it and poke, so you can do what you've been doing. Just save your gale force. Right. Like okay. literally, just start autoing Q, auto Q, back up, back up, back up, and if it gets shitty, you just gale force back. You started doing it the late game. Just do that shit in the mid game. Okay. You'll I'm win because you have levels. Like it's it's I'm it's just level gap. You would have you would have killed Hecarim and then the game would have just collapsed around them because then you would have like I said that Baron was free at that point. But the minute that you right. died, you tragically died. Then your teammates all died after because you know because like, they got queue. baited from, from me yeah being solo there. queue sometimes. But whatever, right? You know that shit will happen. Okay. Just in the future, recognize like when you have levels, don't see somebody and think, oh, I gotta run from him. No, slap him in the head, tank a tower shot or two. It's okay, you'll live. <laughs> Like yeah, that's why that you makes... that's why you you know that's why you're there is because you you want them to try to stop you okay yeah yeah, yeah cool, no, man. I, got, I definitely got it all right so, cool. <clears throat> shoot me a message in a couple weeks <laughs> let me know if you want to do some homework the homework would be just show me a situation like that where instead of fucking being weird you just fight it out and kite okay easy clips cool. I'll, I'll do that all right yeah, man yeah, thank yeah. you so much for the support i appreciate it yeah of course man thank you right. thank you brother peace yep bye all right guys what'd you think okay so I'm surprised when he was going to this replay, he didn't talk about anything about the Gale Force usage. The Yasuo's Gale Force usage could have been a little bit better. And some, like, 
And the 1v1 against uh, Alawi in the top lane? Where was it? Um, it was somewhere like right here. You can notice. Not here. It was actually right here, yeah. If you notice right here, he didn't talk about this one. This is actually interesting. So, he goes in. And then the Gale Force usage. Good win wall though, like, like I said. He ults here. Why does he Gale Force? I don't see... He didn't... He used to use Gale Force to dodge a tentacle. Like... I could Gale Force to the side and dodge it. Uh, I don't know. Like, and there's another ones in the jungle where he kind of used it for no reason. But there's more Gale Force usages here. I'm not going to go over them. Secondly, the build. <laughs> the build was the biggest thing. If he's going to go Bork, he should just go Hullbreaker after and just do like a split pushing build or some chat. Uh, and then Bloodthirst is just better in team fights because, you know, big damages or whatever. And yeah. <laughs> Sec thirdly, um, I will say it is not worth, uh, why wouldn't Nice tell him dodge full AD? Yes, I would dodge full AD. This game does look very, very hard. It sucks. Um, but that's whatever. <laughs> but you know, if this person wants coaching through this game, it's whatever. Like it's, it's time basically. It, it's time related. Like you, you book coaching, you're like, okay, let's do it. Oh, we have to wait five minutes for a dodge. Okay, let's just, you know, it's a waste of time for Nisa's time. And then if this guy co wants coaching right now, it's a waste for him to wait. It's basically wasting kind of Nisa's time, and Nisa doesn't want that. Uh, secondly, some wards. Yes, over the walls, some of that. And thirdly, is it worth 350? Uh, in my opinion, no. But and, and this guy had an 82% win rate on Yasuo. So, like... You know, what, why is this guy want coaching for someone to tell him, don't worry, you don't, you don't need to be nervous. It's super weird to me. I, it's so weird to me that this guy wanted coaching as well. I actually think he would have done maybe a little bit better if someone isn't talking through your head um, in this certain game. But mainly it was the build path that would just, it was just scrambled everywhere. So... Uh, maybe, and like, like I said, Nice doesn't know anything, um, he doesn't play Yasuo, so he doesn't obviously know the build path and stuff like that. Um, otherwise, for me, definitely not worth 350. This guy, you know, wanted it, so he got it, and what would I rate this session overall? I'd actually rate it a B. It was, some things he did say early were good, and all that stuff, you know, some things were on point. Some things I wish he did go over were some of the mechanics of Yasuo and stuff like that. But other than that... Oh, and the build path. Oh, yeah, the build path. I don't know anything about Yasuo's build path right now. I did my research in one minute, and I figured what was the most efficient than how, the way this game was going. There was needed a Grievous Wounds at some point. Even if you hate going Mortal Reminder on Yasuo, at least these guys were building armor. This guy's building armor. Hecarim has natural armor, so it's not a bad thing they also get armor penetration. But uh, third, like I said, fourth item would have been armor, uh, Grievous Wounds thing, Mortal Reminder. Third item would have been... Oh, I wish he would have gone Gale Force, uh, Bloodthirster, go Mortal Reminder, third, or GA, whatever floats his boat. And he's supposed to get both, add four items, but not this Immortal Shield Bow and Blade Rune King. That is a, this Blade Rune King is a split pushing build into Holebreaker. Holebreaker should have been somewhere, if if he wants to team fight, like I said, Bloodthirster. Although, I respect the Holebreaker split push build. He did, Nice did say it was a split pushing wonky build. So, good with that, but yeah. Uh, I... I Ma? No, he has to deal with everyone else. Uh, I think there's a heck. You don't get Ma just for Vlad. He has to like space it out properly. Like I said, B, but then item build off. And uh, I wish he did take into consideration some of his uh, Gale Force stuff. And um, saying a bunch of things while he's playing is not my style because I don't want the person to lose his game. I'd rather have him. Absorb the information after in this part. I don't know if that person can take a lot, but yeah, this part is the main thing I go over because this is the most important part where they can absorb everything that just happened. Can't absorb anything while you're in game and, and try to outplay 1v9 Yasuo. So that's that's my take. Anyways. 
I wouldn't pay three fifty. <laughs> I wouldn't pay three fifty. I don't know why people do though, but that's their money. I don't care. They can pay. They can go for Nisa's coaching, and if they want to go to the site, yeah, do it. Fuck it. I like Nice, so I'll buy it too. In fact, maybe I'll sneak in a little undercover coaching session with a mic. We'll see. Anyways, gotta go. Bye.